This section examines the exhaust gas oxygen sensor. The oxygen sensor, also called a lambda sensor, is mounted in the exhaust manifold or the engine pipe. Its sensing portion is exposed to the stream of exhaust gas. It detects leftover oxygen in the exhaust gas and sends the data to the control unit. The control unit uses it to fine-tune the pulse it sends to the fuel injectors. The sensor consists of a tube closed at one end and made of zirconia ceramic or titanium ceramic. Its inner and outer surfaces are coated with platinum. The outer closed end is covered by a louvered metal shroud that protects it from breakage but still lets the exhaust gas contact the tube. Its inner surface is in contact with the air. A wire contacts the inner surface of the tube through a spring and an electrode bush. This provides the electrical link to the control unit. The inner and outer surfaces of the ceramic tube are coated with porous platinum. The side facing the exhaust gas has a highly porous ceramic layer on top of the platinum which lets oxygen through. The ceramic tube with its platinum electrodes is now a porous solid electrolyte. At temperatures around 350 degrees it becomes a conductor. One side detects the level of oxygen in the exhaust gas. The other detects its level in ordinary air. If the levels are different, a voltage is generated between the two sides. The control unit compares this voltage to a preset level. Below the level indicates a lean mixture. Above it means a rich mixture. The control unit may then adjust the pulse to the injectors to maintain correct mixture. This fine tuning is needed for the catalytic converter to function properly. Some sensors have a built-in heating element powered by the vehicle's electrical system.